I think everything inspires me creatively. Um, and that goes from music to architecture, to art, to graffiti, to um, yeah, street art, to um, abstract things, to the most random things like, like what nature can give you, you know, whether it's sunsets or just a weird cloud formation or, you know, all that stuff inspires me. I, I am a very visual person. I, I like, I look at a lot of things. I am maybe looking too much at things uh, in general. So those, all those things inspire me creatively. Um, like this space in particular is, is a very um, inspiring place. And if I would work here, I would be definitely more creative than if I was working in a very empty space with only four white walls. Because there's a lot of inspiration and there's a lot of style. There's a lot of everything from fonts to, you know, to designs. Everything inspires me. A brick wall could inspire me. Looking up at the 24-7 HH lab with the decks. Used to be a skater. Um, I, I would say that a lot of the, the skateboarding uh, culture helped me to get really into music as well. Like all the skate films had so many different styles of, of genres of music from rock to punk to hip hop. So I think I, I, I really started to learn about a lot of music thanks to um, skate films, skate movies, definitely. And I, I still watch um, uh, uh, some old school films sometimes just to, to, to remember some songs that I forgot about. And um, you know what I've been watching at the, this last week? It was a long time. Kids. Remember that film? Yeah, Rosario Dawson's first film, Kids. And Harold Hunter, who unfortunately uh, died. But um, yeah, Rosario. Who, who is also the ex-girlfriend of a good friend of mine. <laughs> My favorite uh, classic skate film is probably Hocus Pocus from H Street with um, Matt Hensley. He was one of my favorite skaters. I think that's the first time that I saw a front foot impossible uh, in a film. You know, you remember that trick, front foot impossible? Probably, yeah. So, great skate film, great music, great way of filming because that's important as well you need to find a good way to film you know and that was more of the vhs style you know i like that it's coming back vhs style well i think at some point um when it gets too too clean and too like you know this the, the new tvs like when when it's like it's more than hd you know it makes a film look ugly or a film look like um uh, B series, you know, like like second division TV shows. So it's not good to have it too too clean. You need to th that little grain on a, on a film to make it warmer. Because when it's too too clean, it becomes cold. <laughs>